Darwin Spencer here with Crane Cutter Company at the 2022 Surfaces Show, showing the new Crane 515. This is our mini stretcher. It's going to do a couple things for us. It's going to allow us to stretch in rooms and also manage and manipulate seams for seam repair. First thing you'll notice is we've got a tail laid on here. We've cut the material away. The reason we did that is we wanted you to be able to access the blade and the carpet better to set it on the strip when you're using it as a mini stretcher. I can take a stretch on this carpet, I can pull it up and bring this bubble out, set it on the strip, release my stretch. Now, this is set up like the standard old school style where the handle is pointed towards the wall. You had to reach out to apply pressure. It was a little bit awkward. What we've done is we've made it so you can run it either way. Quick release on the blade, quick release on the head, Turn them around. Now I've got it more like a power stretcher. The handle is at my hip. I can set up on the handle, use my body weight to press down to put the, the stretch on the carpet. Same thing, the blade goes behind the strip. I can take a stretch, rub the bubble out, set it, release it. Feels a lot more like a power stretcher this way, which I like. Uh, you also notice these grenade pins on top. When I pull those and release them, I now have opened up the tool to its full capabilities as far as swivel on both ends of the tool. I'm gonna pull this blade off, put this other head on, see this swivel feature, really cool. Go across the seam, come down to the end, you'll see that it's 3 8 gap all the way down. So what I'm going to want to do is I'm going to want to pull this carpet together and align this pattern this way. Real simple, open it up, slight pressure. Once I'm where I want to be, I can lock this tool, release it. There's very little lash back or opening of the seam when we release the lock button. It's nice and tight, stay tack it, do whatever I need to do to prep it to start my seaming. A couple other things we can do with both these attachments on once I've released it, taking that stretch off. I can also do a crab walk technique down linear to the seam, parallel to the seam. If I've got a skew here or pattern misalignment, I can work that one direction. I can work a bubble one way, get my pattern lined up without all the trauma and the chaos of a kicker on, a, on the edge of a seam. That's really hard on the carpet. This is precision, this is control, and a lot more pressure and tension on the carpet. You can move things a lot better that way. I'm gonna show you one more feature of this tool. Release. Put a high rise on. Release. Put a high rise on. Now what I've got, nine inches above my surface where I'm seaming. I'm gonna span across my seam. I'm gonna use this tool to manipulate my seam, line it up, bring it together. I'm gonna to be able to pass all my seam technology underneath it. Cool glide, a seamer down, 905 crane iron. All this will pass underneath it easily. One thing I'd like to show you a lot of times Pulling a seam together isn't the problem. Maybe we have an overlap where the seam is on top of each other. Real quick release of the swivel locks up here. Turn them around. Now I can use this as a separator. So if I have any overlap, I can use this without having to bump it with a kicker. It's a lot more control, a lot more precision. And again, it's not as hard on the carpet or the seam. This is the Crane 515. It sells for $360 at all your distributors, crane distributors across the country. CraneTools.com. Thank you.